Hello there. Has been a bit of a mixed start to this weekend, certainly for southern areas, quite a wet one. If we have a look at the earlier radar sequence, a band of heavy rain been pushing its way in from the southwest. This is falling over saturated ground, so it does have the potential to cause some localised flooding issues throughout the day. Turning lighter though as it pushes its way northwards, but stalling across central northern England, northern Wales, will turn into quite a cloudy, damp, wet day here, unfortunately. Further showers pushing into the south could be heavy at times, quite gusty around these as well. Some of the driest conditions though for Scotland, Northern Ireland, a few sunny spells poking through the cloud. Still a few coastal showers to watch out for, but here temperatures around 10 or 11 degrees Celsius. If you're stuck underneath a persistent cloud though across those central areas, it is going to be feeling rather cold, 8 to 9 degrees Celsius at best. Double digit figures further towards the south, but if you are caught out in some of those coastal gusts, then we'll be turning a touch fresher. For those of you that are heading out this evening for fireworks celebrations, really some of the best conditions will be for Scotland and Northern Ireland. Largely dry for most, again just a few coastal showers to watch out for, but temperatures just dropping away a touch underneath some of the clearer spells that are around. An umbrella probably needed across northern England, northern Wales, with further outbreaks of rain at times. Perhaps this slice from southwest England through to East Anglia, where we'll see some drier conditions, but further heavy showers for southeastern areas of England. Again, some thunderstorms are possible. Those will slowly drift their way off further eastwards as we head throughout the night, but relatively cloudy and murky across a good chunk of England. The clearest spells for Scotland, Northern Ireland, so a few fog patches forming, but temperatures also dropping off here the most, perhaps down into low single figures or maybe even a touch of frost in some of the rural spots. Temperatures just holding up a touch more underneath the cloud across England. This cloud, though, will provide a relatively murky start in places, certainly some hill fog, and it will take a little bit of time for that eventually to all clear its way off into the North Sea. Again, some of the fog across parts of Scotland, Northern Ireland could be a bit slow to clear off. Into the afternoon though, a bit of a west-east split in our weather. The showers feeding their way in from the west, again, could be heavy at times, some thunderstorms, maybe even hail in the mixture, but further towards the east, the drier and sunnier spots. Temperatures generally ranging between 11 and 14 degrees Celsius for most of us, but again, just holding on to some quite brisk winds around coastal areas in the south, which will again, just make it feel that bit fresher. For bonfire night itself, then, we continue this west-east split theme. So eastern areas, quite nice and dry for many of us, should provide some nice conditions for firework viewing. Just got to cater for some showers really persisting across western districts. Again, they could be quite heavy still into the evening at times as well. Do keep up to date with the forecast and everything that is heading our way throughout the rest of this weekend and, of course, the new working week. Subscribe to our YouTube channel so you get all the latest updates and we'll see you again very soon. Bye-bye.